Today we'll review probably one of the best utility snowmobiles, Polaris Titan Adventure. Let's go! Hi guys, as usual it's me, just a voiceover, and you are watching review machines. And here it is, utility snowmobile Polaris Titan Adventure. People say, this sled is like a Swiss military knife. The matter is, this sled is so versatile. On one hand, it's a real utility snowmobile. But on the other hand, it also can be used as tourist and even a sports model. Today we have two Titans, and we'll try to find out if it's really so. Well guys, take your seats, it's time to go. The manufacturer says Titan is a versatile machine, it can be used both for recreation and work. For example, this sled is useful for hunting and fishing, cause it has quite a large track and therefore good off-roading capabilities. Besides, Titan is a kind of working horse. It can carry some cargo and tow various objects. Its tying ability is more than half a ton. The flip side, Titan is a recreational sled, for instance for family activities, cause it has two seats and it's quite comfortable. And finally, Titan has some characteristics even of a sports sled. Let's stop for a while and find out why this machine is so versatile. First of all, I want to say a few words about the awesome look of the machine. It's both bright and reserved at the same time. Certainly it's a matter of taste, but it's hardly possible to stay indifferent to it. I think even the design is trying to say us, Titan can be both a working horse and a wild beast, according to the owner's desires. Let's look what we have under the hood, so to speak. The sled is equipped with a motor which is called clean fire. Actually, we don't see now the engine itself, it's the radiator and the muffler. And the engine is behind them. It's two stroke, 800 cc, the power is 155 hp. Clean fire is also used at many different sleds. It proved to be as durable and powerful motor. Under the plastic cover of the left side there is a variator. Actually, the transmission here has both a variator and a gearbox. As a result, Titan has high and low mode of the transmission. We can see the gearbox at the left side of the sled. Besides, we see here the brake system. Well, let's see in practice how the engine and transmission work together. Firstly, it's interesting to see how it takes off. And it was quite impressive, wasn't it? By the way, clean fire engine, even for a sport model, is considered as quite a powerful engine. And for a utility sled, it's a surplus. I really didn't expect such a performance from the UATV snowmobile. It takes off like a shot. Clean fire engine is equipped with a lightweight crankshaft that provides an instantaneous reaction to the throttle. Besides, a two-stroke engine always has better acceleration than four-stroke one. And they are always lighter. Now let's check 0 to 60 miles and the maximum speed. The measurement is slightly rough, but anyway, 0 to 60 takes about 5 seconds. A decent result for an UTV sled to my mind. As to the maximum speed, it's specially limited at 120 km per hour, but we managed to accelerate up to 125. To provide a safe riding, a sled must have an effective suspension system. Let's have a look at it now. Undoubtedly, Polaris Titan has a proper suspension system. At the front, there is an adjustable suspension with Fox Premium Shocks Absorber. The suspension travel is 236 mm. This gear adjusts the hardness. At the rear we also see the suspension with Fox Premium Shocks Absorber. Its travel is 490 mm. The rear system is also adjustable. 
The track is quite large. Its length is 155 inches. The width is 500 mm. The height of the cleat is 39 mm. Now let's find out how to handle this sledge. Well, at least it's easier to handle the sledge than our drone, but let's not get away from the point. The handling of any sled depends not only on suspension, but also on the weight of the machine. That is why the engineers of Polaris company looked forward to make Titan as light as possible, but durable. In order to do that, in the construction of the sled they used a lot of titanium, fortunately not, otherwise it would cost you an arm and a leg, they used a lot of aluminum. As a result, the total weight of the snowmobile is 298 kilos, and that is quite lightweight for an utility sled. So lightweight and the effective suspension provide a perfect handling for such a large machine. Now we see how the suspension works. As to my own impressions, it's neither too hard nor soft, just a middle to provide comfortable riding and good handling. By the way, the rear track has its own articulation. Due to this, the sled has a better traction, and it's a useful solution for moving backward, because the track doesn't bury itself in snow. The Furious two-stroke engine with a decent suspension may provoke you to ride Titan as if it was a sport model making awesome tricks. It's possible to ride on one ski, climb the steep ascents, make jumps and other cool stuff. And due to the wide and long track, it's almost always possible to escape from any snow trap on your own. Also, I should mention that Titan has a lot of equipment that comes complete with the sled. Firstly, there is an awesome color display with all the necessary info and a navigation system. There is a rear passenger seat that can be easily dismantled without any tools. The front handles and passenger ones are equipped with heaters. At the rear we see quite a spacious box that also can be quickly dismantled. Don't forget that Titan is a utility sled, so there is a hitch, and its diving ability is about 540 kilos. At the front we see a power bumper, and also I want to mention these very comfortable footboards. Well, we launched that Titan can be considered as tourist and sports model, but first of all it's a real utility sled. This is a bright example showing us the towing capabilities of the sled. Two Titans help almost three tons land cruiser to escape from a snowy trap. And now I think it's high time to speak about the prices. Nowadays Polaris Titan Adventure costs about $16,000. It may seem quite a lot, but I think it's worth its money. Meantime, this day comes to an end, and we try today to tell you about all the features of this awesome snowmobile. If you want to see more snowmobiles on this channel, please let me know in the comments. And now let's call it a day. Thanks for watching, guys. Please consider subscribing the channel if you like this video. Stay with us, it will be many more interesting materials. Goodbye.